All right, so for our next ab circuit workout, we're gonna be focusing strictly on building the definition of our lower abdominal region. Now remember, this is an area that a lot of people tend to struggle with, mainly due to the fact that the last bit of stubborn body fat that we carry tends to reside on our lower core. So today we'll be doing three different exercises to build the overall vascularity of our lower abs, in addition to elevating your heart rate and giving you a great fat burning workout as well. So the first exercise that we're gonna be doing is called flutter kicks. I'm gonna lay flat on the floor. I'm gonna take both my hands and place them underneath my butt. And from here, I'm gonna extend both my legs. Now, you'll notice here, my ankles are always gonna be elevated two to three inches off the floor. It's really important. I know it seems like a subtle movement, but this is gonna force my lower core to be activated at all times. From here, I'm just gonna alternate legs. I'm gonna raise my right leg up to my waistline, and then I'm gonna to try to break the point of my waistline and bring my right knee up as far as I can until it's level with my right pectoral muscle. From here, I'm just gonna descend my right leg down and repeat the same motion with my left leg. And we're just gonna alternate, right? You can pick up the speed here, get your heart rate up. It's a great way to independently train each side of your lower abdominals. We're going for 30 seconds, here we go. Now that we're done with our flutter kicks, we're gonna to go to regular standard leg lifts. But we're really gonna to try to do them as slow as possible to maximize the overall burn of our lower core. So similar principles apply here, guys. We're gonna take both our hands, put them underneath our butt. This is more just for stability purposes to prevent you from swaying back and forth. We're gonna extend both our legs here, always keeping our ankles off the floor. And I'm gonna simultaneously raise them up to my waistline and then continue to break the point of my waistline and raise my uh, knees up until they're level with my chest. When I reach this point, I'm gonna slowly bring my legs down. Real slow here, guys. Lift up again, and then slowly come down. And you'll feel the burn, but it'll be worth it. 30 seconds, here we go. Remember guys, it's not about speed, it's not about rep counts, it's all about proper form. The order of importance when it comes to building lean muscle is form, rep counts, and then weight. As counterintuitive as that may sound. All right, so our last exercise here is called Y to narrow. Just gonna sit back, hands under the butt, keeping our legs extended two to three inches off the ground. We're gonna go from a wide stance and bring our legs in until our feet make contact Then slowly come out as far as we can and then come back in. <sighs> Looks like this. 30 seconds, here we go. Great burnout exercise for your lower abdominals. Also gonna be activating a little bit of your obliques and your upper abdominals as well. Bring your ankles down as low as possible. And they're never touching the floor. Try to push past your limitations and embrace the pain here. <sighs> 